everyone, I am Gisil Elfo Sliman from BA3A and I am going to discuss the one truly, the cognitive learning truly. The topic that I choose is rhythm. Rhythm is one of the topics in the music. Rhythm is referred to the length of time between each major beat or accent, such as in a piece of music. It is the sequence of sound and silence which make up the rhythm. The first beat of group of regular eventually is bass beat usually feel stronger than the others. Rhythm came from the Greek word rhythmos derived from ring. It means to blow. It is an order alternation or constructing element. Rhythm in music, the placement of sound in time. It is a general sense. We have used five types in rhythm. The random rhythm, regular rhythm, alternative or alternating rather rhythm, following rhythm, and progressive rhythm. The activity that I want to do with my student is the recall using KWL chart. KWL chart is used for gathering information from the student prior knowledge or experience. This column captures the before what the reader already knew, the during what the reader wants to learn, and after what the reader learned in the stage stages of reading. How to use this activity? We had three steps to use this activity. Step one is to get the student to to brainstorm around the selecting topic and write down everything they know about it in the K column. The step two ask them to generate a list question about what they want to know in the W column of the chart. And step three during our read reading the books or during the lesson we want I want to get the, them to answer I want them to answer this question in the L column. How do I plan to apply this topic and this activity to the cognitive jury? I choose this topic and activity because I think this is suited to the cognitive jury. Since the cognitive jury is more on developing our mental process, memory, or our brain, recalling what they want, but on what they know about the topic will be one of the best examples for this jury. Through this, through this we'll, we will know what their prior knowledge and we can measure their cognitive skills. Since cognitivism emphasizes retention and recall, through the use of quality learning practice. Cognitivism is a learning theory that focuses on the processes involving in the learning rather than on the observable or observed behavior. As opposite to the behaviorist, cognitivism do not require an outward exhibition of learning but focus more on internal processes and the connection that, that take place during learning. That's why I choose this topic and this activity because I will sure that this topic and activity will develop their mental processes. And that's all for the cognitive Thank you.